Hi, hello, it's Leaf, and welcome back to my time at Sandrock. Today, as you can already tell by looking at the lower right hand side of the screen, we have our first sandstorm. And we also have a couple of things to do. So let's get out there, let's check out the sandstorm, and let me tell you, sandstorms are one of my favorite things in Sandrock. Even though they're fairly annoying, but they're absolutely beautiful, I think. Greetings, Skinny Oh, right, arms. and there's Pen. No doubt you've noticed the countless granules of sand being mercilessly tossed about. This is what we in the business call a sandstorm. You don't say. <laughs> I'm here to inform you, as the protector of Sandrock, that you have no need to be afraid. I'm um, not? We do recommend staying indoors until the sandstorm subsides. But in case you must go outside, the church has this free set of sand gear for you. Isn't it nice? These will help you move around in the sandstorm. But they sure as light won't help you much against the ravenous beasts that come out during the storms. And in case you're wondering why I am not wearing any sand gear, to an experienced hero such as myself, these raging sands are but a gentle massage on my chiseled jawline. Oh, so your eyes are just sweating, okay. Well, good chat, skinny arms. Try to remember everything I just said. I'd rather not repeat myself. I saw a crazy big wild yakmo wandering around on the way here, so I'm about to clean it up in a minute. Enjoy your gear! Okay, and we got a sand hat. I'm gonna put it on uh, right away, and I wanna go see that big yakmo. Okay, wait, 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 Pen! Let me help, let me help! I'ma help you, yeah, indeed. There's a big yakmo. I'm helping. Uh, yeah. And we got all the good stuff. Without actually having to fight the yakmo, for real. Uh, say what you will about Pen. He is annoying, he is over the top, but he is good at fighting. He really is. Okay, let's put the stuff away. Yeah. Let's put the meat in the chest. And I really need another chest. Okay, let's check the mail. No, wait, let's pick up the things first because in Sandstorm, wind can blow them away. And my machines have no fuel, no water, nothing. No, mostly no water. We're gonna have to go and buy some water from Burgess at some point. The mail, the mail, from Matilda. Dear Leaf, this sandstorm could not have come at a more inopportune time. Yeah, so no farewell party for Mason for now. Okay, and we also have a letter from Nia, and Nia is our best friend from Highwind. And honestly, I'm not going to be reading all that, because that's a lot of text. Uh, if you want to read it, you can pause the video. And I know it's quite rude of me. And I'm sorry, but she really writes those incredibly long letters and I keep making mistakes when I try to read them. And so yeah, she is our best friend, she is our childhood friend from home, and obviously she misses us terribly. She also studies to become a botanist, and that's all we need to know about her for now. Uh, at some point she is going to visit us here in Sandrock, but not for a, not for a long time, not yet. Okay, so uh, the next letter is from Jan, oh joy. And he, uh, he, he tells us that during the weekends we can inspect items at the guild, but we can't yet because our workshop doesn't have a high enough rating. And the last one is from Chi, and he researched our... what? Ah, a processor. Okay. Right, so now let's go to the guild and take a commission. And I was thinking that because this those uh, episodes are starting to get kind of boring because it's... Uh, same thing over and over again. I'm going to start um, editing out the most boring parts uh, more aggressively. Okay, let's take a commission. And something easy, please. Uh, yeah. Uh, nah. Uh, maybe trough for Elsie or, yeah, grinding saws for Hugo again. Yeah, it's easy to make. It's no trouble for me, but still earns us some experience and money and friendship points. 
Uh, right, and in the last episode, we found that uh, artifact, or rather a piece of it, and we should speak to Katori. Uh, but I don't think I can actually reach her today. Uh, okay, let's speak to Jan first. Hey there! Yeah, hi. Hmm. Uh, Sandstorm's no reason not to finish your commissions on time. Why? Just last year, I mined my wealth, my way through the ruins during an earthquake. Of course, not all of us made it that day. Actually, maybe I called in sick. Uh, yeah. I can absolutely imagine that. So long, partner! Yeah, so long, you brave pillar of the community. Ah, 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 the chest that I was supposed to remember about. Ah... Okay, so what's in it? Two pieces of gold, not bad. Okay, let's take wooden boards. Let's clean up. Ruined paper, great. Okay, so we're gonna go talk to Katori and hopefully she's... No, um, hopefully she's at the museum, but I doubt it. No. I see that the quest indicator is somewhere completely different, not where I'm going. What am I even doing? Ah, uh, she is probably in her room. And we're not gonna be able to talk to her. Unless she is somewhere in the lobby. But I doubt it. No. She is in her room. We can try to climb the stairs and... See if we can... No, nah. You are not here, no. You are inside your room and I can't... I can't enter it. What's here? Oh, an empty room? I, I think it's Ernest's room, actually. When Ernest shows up, he's gonna live in that room. Okay, anyway, we can't talk to Katori today. Unless she leaves her room, but I'm not sticking around to see if she does. But it's all good. It's not that important. For now, let's go home and let's uh, make those grinding saws for Hugo. <laughs> Again, I have flashbacks. <laughs> Déjà vu. <laughs> and you know, we actually have everything we need to make those grinding saws for Hugo, which is great because we can just make them instantly. Like so. And we can bring them over to him. And we're probably going to talk to his entire family, maybe except for Heidi, because she is probably at the uh, construction junction. Because we have a sandstorm and most people are hiding in their homes. And that's actually one of the reasons why I like sandstorms so much. Because the atmosphere is just unearthly. Right, Hugo, I have something for you. But first, let's talk. Uh -huh. Another sandstorm. Hmm, I wonder if I could make a furnace that works inside? Actually, you just need a proper building for that. Never mind, here's your stuff. Uh, already? Hey, not bad, not bad. Here's your payment. Don't do anything with it, I wouldn't. Most likely I'll just buy another chest. Alright, let's talk to Vivi. Hello? Hello? Uh -huh. da -da 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 -da. Uh, I've put a commission of my own and I would be just delighted if you could help me out. I wish I could, but I can't. Sorry, Vivi. Maybe tomorrow. See you. Okay, is there anyone else to talk to? Yes, there is Jasmine, whom I never talk to. <laughs> Hello, Ooh. Jasmine. Sandstorms are so scary. Do you think if I went outside, I would get blown away? Probably not, but you could get lost, so better stay inside. Because if Jasmine got lost, guess who would have to go and look for her? Probably the main character. No, thank you. We are busy enough. Okay, so it seems that Katori is still in her room, and we cannot go talk to her. I mean, we can, but that would be just running around, hoping that she comes out. Uh, I'm gonna go mining for a bit. And as I mentioned previously, I'm probably gonna cut it all out, because this is something very repetitive. Uh, so, unless something really interesting happens, I'm not gonna show it to you, because why would you watch something that I do, basically, every day? Uh, or at least I'm gonna do, basically, every day. And it's gonna look almost the same every time. Instead, I thought I might fit two days in one episode. So this is exactly what I'm going to do today. This is my idea. Tell me what you think. So for now, we're heading into the mines. I'm going to dig out some usual stuff and I'll see you when I'm done. <sighs> so as you can see, not a lot of time has passed. I am already out because 
I ran out of inventory space. My inventory isn't very big to begin with, and I took too much stuff with me because I ran out of space in my chest, so I need a new chest. Oh, and you know what? While we're here, I've been meaning to do this for a couple of days now. I want to place an ad because I can afford it and I want that bonus for completing commissions. It's a no-brainer. I should have done it earlier, but I forgot. Yay! And now we can get another chest. Okay, good. The uh, discount is still in effect. And there's minus 4%. I'm not sure if that's on top of my discount. I don't remember what the original price, discounted price was. Uh, as I always say, aiming is hard, no matter what you do in this game. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Now, let's transfer the things that I carry into the chest. And yeah, I, I said that I wanted to start organizing things. I take that back. I just want to get rid of that, put it anywhere, and go about my day. Hmm. Okay, whatever. Uh, and going about my day means going back to the mines and mining some more. <laughs> because I still have quite a lot of stamina and I want to use it up. Okay. So once again, see you when I'm done. So, I'm still in the mines. Oh, 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 an exploding barrel. Great. Well, uh, that didn't help me. Uh, anyway, I am still in the mines. I am almost out of uh, stam stamina, but I am almost uh, uh, on level 3. I think I should have enough stamina to dig myself through to level 3. And level 3 has 10 ore, which is something I really, really want. Okay. 19 stamina, but it should be enough. And now I absolutely don't have enough st stamina to do anything, but I really want to confirm there's tin, and I know there is, because I really want to start making bronze. And yes, here it is. Let's try to get at least a bit. Okay, right. Okay, so it's still early. It's not even 5 p.m., so I'm going to quickly uh, drop by the Blue Moon Saloon. I'm going to mm, grab a bite to eat, and I'm going to come back here and get that tin. That's the plan. And here I am again to consume unrealistic amounts of food for um, not that much stamina. <laughs> Fortunately, it's not going to be very expensive. I am certain there is such a thing as an optimal ratio of money spent to stamina gained, but I really can't be bothered to test this properly. <laughs> so what I did right now was completely random. Okay, let's talk to Owen. Hi. Howdy. With all the wind and sand outside, it inconveniences everyone. The Blue Moon will still hold stories from time to time, though. <laughs> Gotta give the people some respite, you know. You're always welcome through these doors. I mean, okay, thank you. Alright, catch you next uh, time. This is a public place, though, yeah? Right, so... <laughs> Let's go back to mining. Okay, and we're back. I went to Burgess, I bought some water, uh, then I went and did some more mining. Now we can put the water in a tank, and we can add some fuel to the machines and make some more bronze. Which was the ultimate goal of this exercise uh, in the first place. Right, the water's in the tank. Let's see, rubber scrap. Okay, let's make some more bronze. Okay, that's not a lot, but still better than nothing. And this one is still making copper bars, fine. This one needs some more fuel. Right, uh, now, before this sandstorm blows anything away, because it can happen at any moment, I'm gonna quickly go to sleep to prevent this, and we're gonna do day two. I'll just get rid of some stuff, and see you tomorrow. Good morning, and my machines are out of fuel, and I'm still wearing my sand hat. Okay, let's get up, let's uh, change the headgear, and let's take a look at the world after the sandstorm.
Uh, oh, Hi. Nian. Are you okay? Uh, yeah? Why wouldn't I be? The sandstorm last night was terrifying. I didn't sleep a wink. How are you holding up? Um, it was nothing. Really? Wow, you must be super brave. Hopefully I'll handle it better next time. Oh, poor Mian. Anyway, I was walking around town earlier, looking at the damage, and ran into Matilda. She wants us to go check out that stage outside of the Blue Moon right now, so I came to get you. Come on, she's waiting. Okay, let's go. All right, yeah, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to build rebuild the stage. That's the next big project. Yes. Hello, Danby. Hi. Hello. Do I know you? No, I did not. I did. No, I didn't. After the sandstorm, I'm sure sand removal is top priority. You got. Remember to take care of your machines after it's yes, I know. I know. We're gonna have to make a feather duster. One of my favorite stories is called Feeding the Seedlings. The moral of the story is that if you don't take good care of your plants, they won't grow well at all. Well, yeah. Catch you later. Okay, everybody, what seems to be the problem here? Oi. Oops. Uh, my beautiful stage <laughs> I'm sorry Owen now now at least no one was hurt we can always rebuild true say speak of the devil if it isn't our resident builders here to save the day we are in a real jam here we wanted to do a stage performance for Mason's going away ceremony but now the plans in shambles would you two be dears and find a way to fix this thing up? I don't doubt you'll be up to your eyeballs and other commissions, but whenever the stage is fixed, we can reschedule that ceremony. So I'm afraid I must insist on an official town request of the highest priority. Of course. Heidi, dear, can you draw up a new design? I was sort of expecting the stage to collapse one of these days. So I already designed a new one. Here's the diagram, builders. Oh my, that's great. Why don't you builders decide on which part you want to do? You pick first. I'm fine with either. Okay. Uh, whatever, whatever. Okay. All right, you two. Let me know how it goes. Good luck, and thanks again. By the way, if you guys need it, you can go ahead and salvage this here stage. Stagey would have wanted it that way. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, and I'm so sorry. Okay, but you seem to want something else. Howdy. Hey there, builder. Looks like you survived your first sandstorm. Haha. <laughs> Haha. <laughs> this storm really did a number on my saloon, though. In addition to the stage, I don't suppose you noticed there's something missing around here. The moon sign above the saloon, obviously. Uh -huh. Bingo! The Sandrock skyline just isn't the same without it. I agree. I'm still busy patching up everything here, so I was hoping you could find it for me and bring it back. Um, sure. Yep. The sandstorm was mostly blowing in the direction of the Yakmal Ranch. Do you think you can help me find it? Yeah. Yeah, I can do it. Great, when you go out in that direction, watch out for the rocket roosters. Not a friendly bunch. I'd consider them armed, uh, winged, and dangerous. Oh, uh -huh. Owen, he would be such a perfect dad. <laughs> anyway, if you find it, please install it for me as well. Um, wait, 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 I need to talk to you. I need hey that plus there. one. Uh. Any luck finding the sign? Uh, Owen, I didn't even move from here. <laughs> I'm gonna find so it long, for you, part. don't worry. Even though... We're gonna have to fight for the first time. And also, we need to break apart what's left of the stage. Yeah, which is not something we can do yet. We need to upgrade the tools. So, today, the day is going to be quite interesting, I gotta say. Right, uh, let's check the mail first. Tumbleweed standard. They're just talking about uh, the sandstorm. Nothing particularly interesting. Okay, uh, so what a mess. What do I need to make that feather, feather duster? Oh no, I, I don't have the recipe yet. Okay, let's pick up the stuff. 
Let's add some more fuel. Only four. Okay, well. Uh, yeah. Yeah, we don't have any more dregs, and we should definitely clean up a bit. Um, where to go first? I could talk to Katori, finally. But maybe... Wait a second. No, 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 no. Let me see the map. We have something here. Uh, and here we have the rocket roosters. So maybe I should go and just fight the rocket rooster roosters first. And get the sign. Yeah, that's, that's what we're gonna do. This is actually our first... Uh, our first real fight. Rocket roosters are not particularly difficult, but I am not particularly good. There you are. You explosive chickens. Okay. Mm -mm. Ow. Good. I don't want to alert the remaining rooster, so let's just take the sign and let's get out of here. I mean, it didn't cost me much. Uh, really. <laughs> it was easy. But it's good to think that at some point we're gonna be able to just defeat them in one or two hits. No problem. Wonderful. Let's go install that sign for Owen. Because we like Owen. He's very easy to like. And while we're at it, maybe I should buy... What do I need to upgrade my tools? We are right by the shop, so... Uh, sharpening stone, yeah. The price is not the best, but I need two. That's gonna be... Okay, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Now let's go install this uh, sign... F uh, you know what? Actually, I didn't have to go here. I really didn't. I am not thinking straight today. Okay. But we made it either way, so it's all good. Uh huh. Okay. This is great. It's a hotel again. Ha ha ha. Thanks a million. Owen, your fate has been decided. You're gonna marry Amira, and you're gonna have a bunch of kids, because nobody should tell jokes like that without actually being a dad. Okay, let's go uh, see if there's maybe a chest up there somewhere. Yeah, I should try to remember about those chests, because they are virtually everywhere. I just need to find them. I'm sure there's one somewhere around here. There's definitely one here. Yep. And I got a book. Pioneer. Ah, Owen likes it. Well, not only Owen, but I'm probably gonna give it to Owen. Uh, there's one that I always have a problem uh, getting to. And there's one, obviously. Mm, okay. This is not the most difficult one to get to. But I keep forgetting about it. Uh, you know, but maybe it's not actually the time to run around looking for chests. I could go talk to Katori, but... No, let's go and learn how to make uh, that feather duster, because we're gonna need it not only to clean up our mess, but also for a quest, as far as I remember. Feather Duster. Bye. Yes. Um, commissions can wait. Actually, um... You know, actually I can't decide what to do. We could go and talk to Katori, or we could go and talk to Katori. And here she is! Hello, Katori. I have something for you. Oh, hey there. You got something for me? Well, I'll be darned. This relic fragment. It's exactly the one I was looking for. I can't believe it. Look, look, I have the other fragments right here. 
What a coincidence! Why don't you go over to the restoration machine in my museum and reconstruct this item? Come back when you're done! Okay! And we need to do it now. We can do... I mean, we don't have to do it now. But we have to do it before 6 p.m. Okay, the machine is right over here. Let's restore it. Uh, and let's go back to Katori. And that's the film about... Martle? Okay, Katori, I'm done. Hey there! We can chat first. Ah. So, I couldn't help but notice you keep all your machines out in your yard. My game machines are spick and span, safe for sand damage inside my game center. Are you catching my drift? Yeah, but I'm not putting my machines inside. I don't think I can, actually. Can I? I don't think so. Okay. Now that's a nice looking relic. I'm gonna display it in my museum. Here's something for your hard work. Thank you. Keep your eye out for more relic pieces in the future. Anytime you collect a full set, you can use the restoration machine to reconstruct the relic. I know. Then you can put them on display in the museum. And, I might add, donors will be rewarded handsomely. Okay, so what did I get now? Well, just some experience and some friendship and some reputation. No money, though. Okay. Okay, so I was out the whole morning and I didn't have the time to address the fact that my furnace doesn't have any fuel and I still don't have any dregs, but I have some crystals. Um, okay, let's pick this up uh, and let's make this feather duster. Uh, do I have everything I need? Where is the... Uh, here it is. No, I need some feathers and some thin, thin thread. And the thin thread shouldn't be a problem. It's not. But I need to get some feathers. I did fight with some rocket roosters, but apparently that wasn't enough. Uh, so let's go and kick some trees. Because that's a peaceful method of uh, obtaining feathers. And oh boy, as I'm trying to speak and play the game at the same time, I'm making so many mistakes, like going the wrong way, like just now. Okay, let's kick the tree. And I got some experience and... One feather. Uh, this I can't kick. No. Um, experience, experience, experience. This I can't kick. And I got bark from the previous one. And another tree... And another feather. And I think I have all the feathers I need. And an egg. Okay, unfortunately I had to go find another feather. And I actually found two. But now we should be able to make that feather duster. Oh, come on. Yep. And now, as a proud owner of a feather duster, I can become a French maid. Right. Let's clean up a bit. Beautiful. And we have quite a lot of metal bars, and now we're talking. Now we can start seriously thinking about upgrading stuff. But before I can even start thinking about upgrading and building that stage part, I need to build a processor, and I gotta go talk to Chi to research the other one, but first let's build this processor. And I need grinding saws, of course. Mm-hmm. Well, at least that was painless. Good. Uh, doo -doo -doo, let's put it somewhere. I don't... I don't think I have space here. No. No, 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 no. Let's put it by the door. Hmm. Okay, this should be fine. Great. And this one I'm gonna use to make that uh, stage part, but... To upgrade my tools, unfortunately, I need copper screws, and for this I need to... Go talk to Chi to research the other machine that I keep forgetting the name of. Okay, so this is going to take a while. 
Yo, yo, nerdy guy. Please, hey there. let's mm. chat. When I came here, I was expecting one of two things. Sandstorm was not one of them. Uh, see, your sentence could have sounded wrong on one of two levels. Somehow it sounds wrong on both. <laughs> okay, never mind. I need you to research something for me. Good, sir. Uh, grinder, yes. It's called Grinder. Lovely. Goodbye. And it should be ready tomorrow. Which is not bad. And it means that we only have to wait until tomorrow to upgrade our tools. Could be worse. But it doesn't change the fact that I did screw up a bit. Should have done it sooner. Okay, I think I could start assembling this uh, stage support because I don't need a grinder for that. I just need to assemble the stage support quickly enough uh, because I'm gonna need to uh, upgrade my tools and I need a grinder for that. Okay, I need those wooden boards. Uh, not here. In the processor. I need to focus. All right, and let's add some fuel. And let's make those wooden boards. Uh, do I have anything else to install? Oh. Wrong key. I have bronze bars. Okay, and I need stone slate, and I can make it here. Uh, but, oh, I forgot. <laughs> I forgot it's level one. And it can only make one thing at a time. Ah. Well, in that case, uh, I'm gonna go and find something else to do. Maybe take a commission. That's a good idea. Actually, I changed my mind. Uh, I think Burgess has a quest for me, which is always more interesting than a commission. Mm, unless it is what I think it is. Good day to you, builder. I was just looking it for is. you. Oh well. I came by to ask you to fill out a survey. It's something the church gives to all newcomers. Very standard procedure. Care to take a moment to fill it out? Uh, sure, I've got time. Wonderful! First question. How often do you follow the rules? Um... Uh... Okay, I always follow the rules. Mm-hmm, I see. What are your opinions on bandits? Well, uh, that's an interesting question. Uh, <laughs> they're cool. Uh, no, maybe they're just misunderstood. <clears throat> mm -hmm, I see. And finally, what are your feelings towards water wasting? Um, I try not to waste water. All right, then. Let me truthful. just run the numbers here and... Uh, hmm. Well, the bad news is, you're not quite ideal Sandrock citizen material, but the good news is, you have lots of room for improvement, and you can start improving right this very minute. You don't say. So, the short of it is, there's some sand on the plants and flowers in our temple garden. If you could go clean that up for us, that'd be great. Well, thanks in advance. May the light follow you always. Uh, you made a mistake here. It's may the force be with you always. Oh, by the way, you'll need a feather duster to clean up the plants. You do have a feather duster, don't you? Yes. They're all the rage these days. Um, sure, especially with the sandstorms. Yeah, and that's exactly why I made that feather duster. Okay, let's go and get that done. I just noticed that the quest is named Instant Karma. Apparently it's my good deed for the day. A good deed that I hope to be paid for. In some manner. Okay, let's clean that up. No, oh, and I get dregs from that, which is very useful. Wait, did, didn't Burr just say that there are, there, there are some plants here? There were no plants under the sand. Oh, well. Right, all done. Okay, Burgess. No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. Wait. Well done. If plants could talk, I'm sure they'd say, Thank you. 
Oh, and I'm sure your machines would appreciate it too. A good clean should get them working good as new. I already took care of that. As no good deed should go without a reward. Here, take this. See you later. And I got some water. Just one. Well, I guess it's better than nothing. Okay, I think it's time to take a commission because the day is ending. And we haven't done it yet. Let's take... Um, oh, let's take the one for Elsie. Because it's easy. And I still have plenty of stamina. Uh, okay, I could gather some stone. I have everything I need uh, to make those stone troughs for Elsie, but... It would be a shame not to use that stamina, actually. And probably after I'm done, I'm still gonna go and gather some more materials. Because there's no such thing as too many resources. Okay, uh, it's getting late, so I'm gonna go and make those troughs. Uh, yeah, quick build. That was no problem at all. I didn't even have to uh, run around gathering stone. Okay, where is Elsie is at home? Which is rather typical at this hour. Blessings be upon this house. I'm here to talk to Elsie. Hi, let's chat. Mm -hmm. uh, Mian cancelled hanging with me on account of the dang sandstorm. You don't reckon maybe you could just do all the commissions? Well, shucks. All right, I just figured I'd ask. Elsie, the sandstorm was yesterday, and I am just doing a commission for you. Shoot, when did I post that commission again? Yeah, you always say that. Okay, so that's done. Okay, so I'm just gonna uh, gather some more resources and then go to sleep, and that's gonna be it for today. Thank you so much for watching, and... You know, actually, this town, without that sign wouldn't be the same. Okay, thanks again, and I see you in the next video. Take care.